Hey there guys, this is my hello and welcome back to Let's Play, um, Final Fantasy IX. Why did I suddenly forget the name of this game? But we have Garnet in our team. Let's give her some stuff, some stuff. Um, sure. So, in the last video we escaped from the evil forest, but Blank kind of sacrificed himself for us, so that really sucks. But we must move on. Blank gave us a map which should be useful. It should tell us how to get to places, maybe out of the mist, because the mist is nasty, as you see with, well, the mist is nasty, as you can see here, and, um, it generates monsters, like these monsters that we're about to face. So what is up, monsters, monsters? Random encounter that is kind of long, ooh, a snake, and a goblin. We can always use snakes on a plane. Like actually, you know, like plane or plane, you know, like you know what plane and you know what plane I'm talking about. Um, let's steal from you. Can you summon yet? No. I guess that's a shame. That's a flying shame. I think you're a beast, so you're down and you're down. This should be pretty basic. And just in case your fire doesn't kill the snake, which so at this stage in the game, fire is pretty powerful. Vivi is pretty powerful. Yeah, Vivi kicks some major ass. It's pretty lovely having Vivi kick ass like a fire pyromaniac. Who doesn't love who doesn't love pyromania? So Blank told us to go to a cave to the south, but I'm going here because I want to visit this little landmark. It's a very optional place to go, so don't worry, but this is question mark. Welcome to question mark everybody. The best place on earth. A tourist attraction, question mark it is. Ooh, pretty. What is this place anyway? Where are we? Oh, this is North Gate. It's between Alexander, Alexandria and Bermessia. Beneath the mist and- But you said it's closed, right? Melda Arch or something? Melda Arch. Not related to Zelda in any way. <laughs> Shut up. Fresh print- Fresh prints. And there's a smoke rising. Is somebody dying? Or is it civilization? The flag! That is Alexander's war baron banner. War banner? We're in war? How dare they commit, commit crimes in the name of Alexandria? I guess, yeah. That is pretty true. Why are they being all false about this? We're in war and all. I like to arrest and punish them in the, if the circumstances weren't different. Why did why did it, why did the flags look like the communist flags from Russia by any chance? You know the hammer and the sickle. They have a nice last of the arch. Let's follow. The, we'll follow the ledge. Sure, <laughs> as if they're directing us. You know the way to go. Since I guess there's something we got lost and all. But what is this here? Listen close. Ooh, wait. Listen close. I said. Hmm. Metal grinding. Anybody there? Y yes. Oh, it's a woman. That voice. It's a chick. <laughs> of course, that's a what a sexy, sexy husky voice. Oh, I've it sound very sexy and husky, huh? <laughs> Stretching himself and all. I sell medicine. Well, is he tough? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, do you remember that you're with, with girls and all, so... With a girl, so don't even... Oh, just potions? Screw you, then. I don't want to deal business with you. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get this treasure chest. Because why not? Some eye drops. We used some eye drops before because we were running low because we were getting blinded by the plant monster thing. But now we should be... Now we should be on our merry way to... Destination. Thank you for loading, game. Oh, PlayStation. Oh, PlayStation. That's why I owned an N64 back when I was a kid. So why am I playing a PlayStation game now? Because I love this game so damn much. I do, really. You wanna try me? I'll face you. Come on. What is this monster here? Snakes! Moving on south to our destination, whatever it is. Supposedly there's a cave we're inter interested in, so why not? Oh, random battle. Oh, you silly bitch. Oh, random battle, you silly bitch. I'm gonna kill you in your sleep, random battle. What are we up against? Uh, snakes. More snakes! Yay, Garnet is leveling up. She's catching up to us. Yay! Except she sucks. She's a white mage, so she can't attack. But it's good. She's in, she, she can just support us. I mean, there's always the supporters in games. Ass Cavern. Ass Cavern. Yes, let's go into the Ass Cavern. <laughs> that came as an accident, but why not? Accidents are fun. So this is where we're supposed to go? Why are we supposed to go into a cavern of ice? 
And why is it? Why is there suddenly an, an ice cavern in the middle of nowhere, right next to a forest? Doesn't that make no geographical sense? Oh, whatever. Uh, um, what's up, Phoebe? Have you ever heard of the, Have you ever heard of that ice cavern? Sure. What is, is this place? I think so. It's supposed to be near the evil forest. I've heard of it. It's supposed to be be a beautiful place covered in ice, except it's cold. My grandpa told me about this place. He said the cavern takes travelers to the top of the mist. Oh, that's nice. We should go. That'd be nice for us, you know, being away from the mist. Bravo! Master Phoebe's grandfather must be quite the scholar. We must think him upon escaping the mist. My grandpa used to teach me lots of things, but he passed away. Oh, that's really awkward. Way to go, Steiner. Way to go. Oh, forgive my indiscretion. Don't worry about it. Well, why don't we go inside? Yeah, let's go inside of the cold place and freeze our asses off. off. Welcome, everybody, to... The Ice Cavern. <laughs> so cold. Wow, what a beautiful place. This is not beautiful at all. Okay, maybe those flowers that are frozen. I guess being there is better than reading about it. This is like this is like your first time on an adventure, princess. Please don't touch anything. Yeah, this is your first adventure, and you're having overproductive git with you. That's lovely. So if we touch this thing, I mean, okay. Well, first of all, treasure. Yay, a tent. So basically, if you see those things blowing, if we touch those, we get into the random battle. So that's what happens. So don't be stupid like me. I mean, I, was, I did that on purpose just for demonstration sake, and we have a. Um, a mammoth that's kind of like a warthog, except it had its nose, nose cut off, I guess. So it's like a warthog with no nose. Come on, get to Zidon. HP switching? What the heck is that? Well, whatever it is, you're gonna die. <laughs> um, sure, black magic, why not? Let's, con let's continue using BB's magic. BB's magic? It's Phoebe's magic. Yeah, burn the bitch! Oh my god, 252. That's a bit too extreme, Vivi. So powerful, so powerful. I love you, Vivi. I really do. Flan card. Yeah, so as you can see, it's easy for you to get cards even though you don't go out of your way to get cards. So it's easy for you to get them passively. Wait a minute, wait a minute. What was that? Oh, I can go down, that's all. I like how the move music just has drums and like... Before we got into the random battle, of course. Millions of angles and what the heck are these? They look, they, look, they look like Jello. Jello. Head attack. Ooh. Hey. Don't hit her. Don't give her head, I mean. That sounded worse than I wanted it to. Ice. That's not good at all. Ooh, that hurt. You know, maybe you could have her heal us a little bit. We're getting low in HP a little bit. Especially since. Ow, oh, that's gotta hurt. Unless Vivi kills them all. Like, kills them all. That, I mean, they should be weak to fire. Yeah, they're weak to fire. Of course. They use Blizzard primarily, so why not? Yay, Vivi! You're awesome! As always! Tell me something I don't know, Vivi says. Boost his self-esteem. He needs a self-esteem boost. I mean, he's awesome. Vivi is just amazing. I love Vivi. Let's use Cure. Thank you! So, what does Panacea do? Venom and Poison. Okay. And there's some other stuff. Protect. Which can be useful, useful in battle. And Bahamut. Oh my god, you know Bahamut? But you don't, have, you don't have enough MP. Well, that's a shame. What about Shiva? Or Ifrit? Or Atomos? Or Odin? Huh? What about those? Huh? Why can't you use those, huh? 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 I'm being obnoxious, aren't I? Good! So there's something interesting. Crap. Okay, so moving on. Look at this ice sea wall here. Who oh, was this? Cutscene time! <laughs> Look, everyone is just freezing their asses off. You can see their breaths and all. What a strange wall. There's got to be something behind it. Always does. This is an RPG after all. There's always stuff hidden behind stuff. Gee, so demanding. Stop enslaving him. You, you know, being all like, Slave, use your magic! Nay, oh, that's pretty effective. Nice, Vivi. Okay, good to know. Yep, there's plenty of walls like this. Yay, Vivi, you're awesome, Vivi. And stuff like that, etc., etc., etc. Yay, all that for an ether. That's. Oh my god, oh my god. Ah. Okay, so as you can see here, Sana learned. gained enough AP to learn Bird Killer. 
So he's a bird killer. Yeah. And stuff like that. So let's heal Zidane because... So those beasts know a move called HP switching. So it switched its HP with Zidane's. And it had 21 HP. Well, not anymore. It switches it on. So that's annoying. Jeez, man. Jeez. Oh, there's a way around. So let's... Uh, random battle. Why are you so annoying to me? Let's sing opera, man. What is that thing in the middle, anyway? Why'd you get to attack right away, man? Stop cheating. Jeez. Cheater. Cheaters never win. Neither do dancers. What the heck is that, anyway? Sleeping juice? Don't give me a juice! Oh, ew! You just squirted juice all over Garnett's face! Ew! Look, okay, stop blizzarding. I don't appreciate it if you blizzard me, man. Especially if it hurts. Blizzards hurt, you know. Kill them with fire, please, Phoebe. Kill them with fire! Everybody must die! Yeah, that's the way to go! Thankfully, sleep gets nullified at the end of the battle, so that's nice. Ooh, we've learned thunder. Excellent. 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 Now what else can um, Silk Shirt teach? Cure. But Garnet already has a Silk Shirt, so I think she's good. Well, in that case, let's go around and avoid that little misty thing. Okay. Go away, go away, go away, go away. Ah! I swear, those beasts are so annoying when they use HP switching. It's like, dude, are you like trying to piss me off or something? Are you trying to tell me something here? Huh? You, I mean, stop switching oh, HP. Stop prolonging the battle artificially with a weird ability that doesn't make any sense. Okay, I'm gonna have to wait for you. There we go. That's the way to go. That's the way to do it. I like it. Hostess and a bunch of other stuff. Yay! That made no sense. So there should be another wall for Vivi there, I think. Let's wait for this to subside. Here it- Oh! Oh god, a back attack now! Okay, now we're pretty now we're pretty vulnerable, and it's gonna take a long time for us to have our ATB bars actually fill up. Oh, oh, of course you put Vivi to sleep. You know what? Screw you guys. I'm fleeing here. I'm fleeing this battle. This is not worth fighting. This is not a battle worth fighting for. So the Sedan's ability flee allows us to escape for sure, but it's gonna have to take a little while. There we go. We're good. Bye, Vivi. <laughs> Okay, we do drop some money, but I think we have enough money to not care, so who cares? But yeah, have fun, Vivi. Ooh, another icy wall. Guess what that means? Vivi time! It's Vivi time! <laughs> boom, boom, doo, doo, and stuff like that. I don't know. Just whatever. Let's get this item here, shall we? Thank you for the elixir. Ooh, elixir. I like elixirs. I like candy. I like cream and stuff like that. And okay, that we. How did we not get hit by a battle? And I think that. How do we get down there anyway? What does that thing anyway? Oh! God damn it! But here's the thing about falling asleep: if you get hit with a physical attack, you get you get wake up. So it's a good thing they put me to. They, it's, a bit, it's a good thing they hit Vivi with a, a rusty knife. Even though being hit with a rusty knife is actually pretty nasty. Oh, you know Panacea, nice. And we get an ore, that's also nice. But yeah, I guess it was a good thing to hit Vivi with a rusty knife so they woke him up so that they could die. Ooh, yeah, I see an exclamation point here. That's a trigger for something. Ooh. Burn that log, yeah. I think if you want to get the potion before, <laughs> you won't get it. But yeah, I like how they were like, whoa, what the heck is, what the heck is this dude? That was so sudden. Mage Master. So we have the same Mage Master as before, so just in case you didn't get the Mage Master the first time against Baku, there you go, that's your free Mage Master right there. But you get to learn the abilities much later on, so you suck. That's right, if you get it now, that means you suck. Hmm... Now how to get that thing over there? That is interesting. First of all, let's get this. 
because it's more of a, a, a value, a, a, a valuable. Jeez, I can't speak all of a sudden. That's right, this is another VV wall. Why do we have to be all repetitive being like, what's this? Whoa! And yeah, stuff like that. But this allows us to get this item over here. What is it, I wonder? Let's see, let's see, let's see. What, it could, be, what it could be? Leather wrist. People already have the leather wrist, right? Let's see here. What can the, what can the leather... You know what? Who needs this the most? Vivi. He can learn Blizzard now. Awesome. 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 Yeah. Oh, monster. Not awesome. No. Okay, so now let's get out of here and go towards the path over there and dodge the misty mist. Come on, dodge the mist. Go over there. Avoid any random battles. I think we're good here. Oh, a three-way or a two-way, a branching path. Let's go over here first because I like going left. I like left thinness because I'm a left-handed dude. Hello. Oh my god, you're frozen. Oh no. Poor Mog. Poor Moogle, I mean. Oh, he's alive. You bastards! Whoa. Such language. What an ungrateful little Moogle. What a son of a bitch. Active time event? What is this? Oh, no, 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 no. I don't need the notice. Scoop this. Okay. Stop this tutorial crap. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I don't need I don't need your freaking lectures. Get away. Oh no 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 uh, Thank you. <laughs> okay, well, that was very unpleasant right there. Let's just um Let's see here. Do you have anything more? Sure, I'll deliver a letter to Gumo. And maybe I'll have a tent here. Because, you know, we have tents here, and tents heal us. So it's nice. Let's all get cozy together. All four of us is in this one tiny tent. That's pretty uncomfortable. That's pretty awkward, too. I imagine if all four of us sleep in the tent, then Steiner's, Steiner's going to be like cr crushing us all with this metal weight. It's going to be very uncomfortable and very awkward. Especially with Garnet sleeping. And preferably, Garnet is sleeping naked, so that we can all see. Because back in the day, everybody slept naked, I bet. Especially Garnet. Is oh, yeah. It'd be pretty weird for Vivi to sleep, I think. Can the wind just pass? Alright, okay, we're okay. It's not the normal mist that we saw before, but it is pretty windy. What is it with this wind, anyway? Vivi, hurry up, or you'll be left behind! I'm coming! Oh, it's so cold! <laughs> it is pretty cold. Come on, we can get through this. Oh no! Vivi! Oh, oh my god, no, 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 no! Oh my god, are you dead? No. Vivi! Okay. Steiner. Oh. You fainted. Whatever. Yo, Rusty. You, you're not alright, are you? What happened to you guys? Yeah, what is going on anyway? Hey, Rusty. Move it or lose it. Get up. <laughs> just kick him into armor. It's... Uh, oh. Oh, you too? Oh, that's just great. Yeah, this is pretty bad. This is a pretty bad situation for us to be in. Being all sleepy in the cold. Okay, now we're just asking to die. And so we all froze to death. And that is the end of Final Fantasy IX. Goodbye, everybody. Or not. I guess... Wait, the bell? I heard a bell, right? What was that? It came from over there. Is somebody there? Hmm. Let's see here. Come on. Move faster, Zeron. Let's investigate. Actually, am I ready? Because I want to make sure I have the best around. Okay. I have the best around stuff on. Because as you can guess, something is weird here. And if something is weird, it's better to be, be prepared. Why didn't you fall asleep? You should be dead by now. What is... This? That looks like a black mage, except he's evil. He's a black waltz, number one. Are you the one causing this blizzard? What a bastard. <laughs> That's right. What is that little thing getting bell for? Okay, and it's a boss battle. Well, that's just great. We're gonna die. Because we're by ourselves. Yep, we're alone. Well... I mean, it's only a black mage. How could this be bad? We've seen much worse. Ice giant. Sea lion, come before me! This is bad. Oh my god! This is really bad. Go, sea lion! 
I don't want to be Zidane. Oh, you hit me with a wing. I feel bad. You should feel ashamed of yourself. And he's using, using fire, even though I thought he would cast Blizzard, you know, since he has a Blizzard on us, but sure, whatever floats his boat. Let's just keep, let's just focus our attacks on the Black wal Waltz, or let's hope that our Trance Bar will fill up, because I feel like having Ultimate Trance will be nice for this fight, because we're being assaulted here, we're alone here, there's something very wrong with this image, fighting alone. Okay, and we're gonna get blasted with the Blizzard, this is gonna hurt. Oh, Ow. But that's not bad. Okay, stop hitting me with death. Can I please be in trance now? No? Can I perhaps kill you, Black Waltz? Ugh, sea Lion, kill it for me. Oh, how convenient. You're dead. And. Okay, now I'm in trance. Except now I want to steal from the Sea Lion, so. I think this trance came at a bad- Oh, I got a Mythal Dagger. You know what? Now it's time for trance because that's the item I wanted. I don't care if I'm dying. Let's use some expensively dying. Let's see, which, which one does- Let's use this one. Actually, yeah, let's do Tidal Flame because if we, we haven't seen it yet. It's the first time I'm using it, so... Yeah! How do you feel? Tsunami? This could be bad. SHOOT! Oops. Um... Well... This is embarrassing. Okay, so I have a new strategy. First of all... I'm going to heal myself and be smart and heal myself. Because that's what I didn't do last time. Also, I, I focus on stealing before I attack them all. Oh, now I get to have my turn. After I got hit a bunch of times. But yeah, I've decided to steal the Mythal Dagger from the Sea Lion before commencing to attack. Now I'm gonna heal myself like a smart ass, and ne the next time I attack, I'm gonna use Tidal Flame and kick their asses. They're gonna die. Oh yeah, they're gonna die. They're gonna die. I'm gonna kill them. Yeah! Yeah! Ow. S that hurts. Stop it. Get ready to eat some Tidal Flame. Oh yeah! <laughs> I like how this, um, Tidal Flame just kills him in one hit, and I think that whenever he rings the bell, or whenever I use Dine, it'll ki um, kill me. I mean, he uses Tsunami as a counterattack, I think. So let's hope that this final Dine will kill him, otherwise I'm screwed. Come on, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Free energy. It should be spontaneous, right? Yes, 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 yes. Okay, we, now we did it. Now that's how you fight him. Now that's the way it goes. Yes, 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 get out of the trance. We won. Good job, Sidon. Good job. Good job. 9,000 backflips, a split one fitness of say, or 800, whatever. Did we learn anything? No? Fine. But we won against the Black Waltz and the Sea Lion. That's the important part. You defeated number one, but number two and number three will reclaim the. Oh. You defeated number one, but number two and number three will reclaim the princess. Who's there? Oh, whatever. I gotta go back and check on them. So there's two more Black Waltzes, huh? Appropriate that there are three Black Waltzes. Oh wait, that was Zorn and Thorn. Wrong voice. Oh, whatever. Zorn and Thorn's voices are annoying anyway. Ah, uh, good morning, everybody. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Sedan. What's up, dudes? Hey there, everybody okay? You! What just happened? It was no big deal. Oh yeah, just only a boss battle and just death, that's all. And a Mythal Dagger, I got a Mythal Dagger. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! Did Daryl touch you? What?! That's the first assumption you make? <laughs> Jeez, man, I love this game. Yeah. Oh, nothing. Just some evil waltzes and all. I mean nothing. So we got a Mythal Dagger, which should be nice, except I want to save it for after we get, after we learn these abilities, which should only be a battle away, so it's a bit frustrating that it's only a battle away. Away! Okay, now we're all healed up, and healed up, healed up, everybody. 
So let's make our way to the exit of the area. Is there anything down? Nope. Okay, let's go up. So I think we're pretty much done with this dungeon here. So in the next video, we'll be getting out of this cavern. I'm going to be stopping the video here because there's going to be a battle. Okay, Zidane learns to detect and flee, so now he can get rid of the Mage Master and use the Mythro Dagger that he obtained from the Sea Lion battle. Yay! So Bandit, so Bandit is kind of interesting because, check this out, equip... Yes, we need this very much. But yeah, we're going to be exiting the cavern in the next video. So until then, see ya. Have a good day. Bye.